always on the lookout to find fonts that we could use for our logos when we're designing. In this video, we're going to be looking at 15 fonts that you could keep in your bag of tricks and use them with your logo design. Before we jump into our fonts video, Canva just recently announced their partnership with Monotype. This means that we are getting more than 1,100 curated fonts on the Canva platform. Awesome. This means that this partnership is going to provide us with high quality iconic types of fonts that we could use for our designs. Fonts like Helvetica, Cotoris, Snell Roundhand and many many more. Quite exciting. Let's jump in on our video. The first font that we're going to be looking at is called Lovely May. So you're going to click on your drop down arrow and then look for Lovely May. Lovely May is elegant and it's organic and you can use it in a great different ways when you're designing a logo. We've used it on this logo and we loved it. Our next font, I really loved this font, is called Brown Sugar. This is how Brown Sugar looks like. Brown Sugar font is a serif font that has a touch of modernity on it. We've used it on this logo and I absolutely loved this font. The next font is called Tomorrow Thin. We used this font on this logo and when you are creating this logo and you want a thin size with a little bit of shapes in it, Tomorrow Thin is just perfect for that. Our next font is Daydream. Daydream has handwriting on it and you can use it on your designs when you're looking for a handwritten kind of a logo and Handrim works very well in those instances. One of my favorite fonts would be Pinion Script. We've used it on this logo and it is a very elegant kind of a handwritten logo with roundness and shapes and you know it's very versatile when you are looking for that kind of a elegant handwritten kind of a logo next on our list is 10 headline we used headline on this logo it's big it's bold you could use it when you're looking for those kind of boldness on your logos and we absolutely enjoyed using this font as well. Next on our list is a font called Major Mono Display. I have used this font a couple of times with my logo designs on the channel. It is quite a character kind of a font and when you are using lower caps, it looks completely different to upper caps. So it's very versatile and I love the way that it gives you options to create characters without actually seriously going into a design mode. So my favorite is major mono display. Let me know in the comments below if this is adding value and let me know which is your favorite font. Next on our list is a font called check. How fun is this? If you're looking for your lines and you're looking to create a logo that's clean, very minimalistic, check font is right for you. Next on our list is Sinzel. I've used Sinzel on these two logo designs that I've done on the channel. And they were quite sophisticated and simple, but also quite elegant kind of a font. When you choose the decorative font type of your Sinzel, you start getting those smoother lines and those kind of a design on a logo. And it's a nice font to use for your designs. Next on our list is the Roboto font. Roboto font is very popular. Roboto font is mechanical, straight, sort of architectural kind of a font. And it is formed largely geometrically. And the features of this font are friendly and it has a kind of an open curveness on it. And it has different kinds of Robotos. There's Roboto Condense, Monolite, Regular, and you can really go into a nice design mode using different kinds of Roboto fonts on your designs. Next on our list is Megrim. Megrim font is similar to our major without those design characters on it. Straight lines, 
clean i love mad broom as well and you can use it for your logo designs next on our list is a bar sock font if you want a roundness fun kind of logo maybe you're designing for a crash you need kind of roundness on your fonts for your design, Borsok can achieve that for you. Next on our list is Koini. Koini is round, it is beautiful, it is shapely, and it is quite a nice font to use when you're looking for those kind of roundness for your designs. The next font is Playfair Display. Playfair Display is used mostly on magazines because it's a clean font, easy to read, not a lot of design on it and magazines really love this font as well but we could also use it for our logo design and it has different kinds of playfair displays that you could be creating or using there's a black there's sc and yeah have fun with this and our last font is helimum it is also a handwritten kind of a font with a different kind of a twist from the ones that we've seen i would love for you to let me know your thoughts when it comes to video Videos that are font based if they add value to your life so add comments below for me hit that like button share so that we can help as many beginner designers on canva as possible and i do have another video that i've created that covers fonts on canva you can go check it out here i appreciate your time that you spend with me i will see you on the next video yeah.